welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to do a get ready with me today and I'm in Thailand now. I'm in Chiang Mai and I can't even begin to tell you that this city is just absolutely stunning. It's gorgeous here. Um, but I'm gonna jump right into it. Uh, it's a funny story though. Um, so I'm, I'm 14 hours ahead from my um, home, home time zone and like um, it was so I know in the last video I said that it was hard for me to adjust kind of like in New York but um, oh my gosh it was it was obviously way more difficult for me to adjust here in Thailand <laughs> 14 hours ahead like right now it, it's 8 a.m. here, and for me, back home, it's <clears throat> 6 p.m. yesterday. Uh, which is kind of funny because my birthday was yesterday here in Thailand, but back home, it's, um, it's, it was yesterday? <laughs> I got myself a little bit confused there. But, um, yeah, the, I was like, oh my gosh, I was like wide awake at 4 a.m. in the morning here, and I'm like, literally back at home, it's like two in the afternoon, <laughs> you know? <clears throat> so, for me to like adjust, I mean, I, I'd say I'm adjusted now, and, um, it's good. I mean, I like how I've adjusted because I'm, I'm in the more early bird, uh, I'm more of an early bird person and I've, and I've adjusted to being a morning bird here in Thailand. And, oh, also funny story, I brought my hair straightener and I can't use it because it's I don't have an adapter for one and um, well my friend has an adapter but <clears throat> I'm not gonna be like hey can I use your adapter like every single day well I guess I could but I mean I don't I don't really want to um, and yeah, so I'm like, oh, it's just, now my hair straightener is there, just taking space in my, in my backpack. <laughs> oh yeah, when I was in New York, I picked up some stuff, uh, well, some stuff for myself, and I also picked up some stuff for my niece and my nephews, uh, well, my little cousins, but I call them my niece and my nephew. Um, I know they'll go crazy for it, so, uh. Yeah, I did that, and um, I also picked up some M&Ms, like colored M&Ms. Did you know that they have black and white and gray and like paisley, um, pastel -y pink and purple M&Ms? I had no idea. Apparently they do have, um, apparently we do have an M&M store in Canada. I haven't seen one. Um, but yeah, I was like so. Um, I was so baffled. I was like, "What? That is crazy talk!" Oh, in this little mini beauty blender I picked up from Sephora in New York, and also I picked up. Um, <clears throat> I I picked up this new. Heart um, blush. Actually, um, I got this for my birthday because it was in my birthday month when I was in Sephora. So I'm like, score! Came with it. It was a. Uh, it's a tart lip paint, and I'll put that on later and show you how how it goes on because it is gorge. Um, yeah. 
oh my gosh, and it's funny too, because when I woke up super early, I literally woke up before, I don't know if you can hear, but there's a rooster. I literally woke up before this rooster starts cockle doodle doing. <laughs> so, I mean, that kind of says something if I'm up before the rooster. This is my first time trying this, so I'm gonna give it a whirl. Oh, Felicia? Okay, I need to see. Oh my goodness. Okay. That is very pigmented. It's gorgeous though. It's a really nice color. I just don't want to flop on too much on my face. Okay, I know in the camera it looks like a big pink streak, but in person it doesn't look this bad. <laughs> like this. I mean, it is pigmented, but I mean, it doesn't look this. <laughs> like, it doesn't look like that in person. Oh my gosh. Kelly Kelly. All aboard Clown Town. <laughs> So this is a really nice blush. I mean, obviously, that was my first time trying it and I put on a little bit too much. <laughs> um, a little goes a long way with that, I guess. Um. <clears throat> but the people here in Thailand are so friendly and they're so nice. Like, I, I, I just think they're amazing. And, um, it's so gorgeous here, like the temples are beautiful and um, <clears throat> the city is so ancient and historic and just like the plants and the wildlife and even like these little lizards that I've seen around here. I've seen like a little, a little gaiko <laughs> and I found it just adorable. I'm like, what? It's super cute. I haven't seen any spiders knock on wood. <laughs> Not that I want to, but I mean, I've, it's one of those things that I've always kind of been like fascinated about. Like, I wonder like how big like spiders are over in tropical and like humid places. I mean, I've seen them on like books and stuff like that, but I mean, seeing them in person is quite another. <clears throat> oh, and can we talk about this flight? How long it took me to get here? It was a 16 hour flight from New York to Taipei. And then we went Taipei to Bangkok, and then Bangkok here to Chiang Mai. So, I mean, technically, it took way longer to get here, but just that one flight. And we left at like, our flight left. It was late. It was supposed to leave at 12.20. But. We wound up leaving at like <clears throat> one in the morning. Oh, it was brutal. And I could not, I could just not fall asleep. I cannot do that. I just, I, I don't know how people, I even was wearing one of those little neck brace things and I can't do it. It's just, so I was pretty much awake for the whole, 16 hour flight I was just listening to music and I was listening to music for the most part trying emphasis trying to fall asleep and then I gave up and I'm like okay I downloaded some iBooks for my iPad and I started reading those <clears throat> um, and I didn't even get like a window seat. I got like an aisle seat. So I, I it's not like I, it's not like I could watch, um, watch the clouds or watch the moon. Well, I guess you couldn't really see anything because it was dark, but I'm one of those people where I find, um, I find that very relaxing and I find it uh, very comforting just to, Kind of look out and see the moon and see the 
ocean and the stars, clouds, whatever, you know? I found it very fascinating and very relaxing. And I swear if I did have a window seat and I could see like the stars or the clouds or ocean, I would probably be looking outside like pretty much my whole, the whole 16 hours. So I'm just doing something light. Um, I haven't really been wearing too much makeup while being here in Thailand because it is it's it's really hot and humid here and it's something that I'm not used to. I mean, come on, I came from Canada where it was like minus 40 like the week that I left. And it's like plus 30 here. <laughs> and it's hot and humid. Um, but I, I wanted to put in a little bit more um, effort today. <clears throat> but it is nice to go makeup free and just let your skin breathe and kind of let your skin recuperate. Same thing with my hair, I mean I can't straighten it. <laughs> Well, I could if I want to go and fetch the adapter, but you know what? I'm just going to let my hair have a break and just kind of be, because I, I bleached it, like, I bleached the crap out of it, I toned it. I did quite a lot to it, so I mean, Kelly, I should slow down. Oh, and can we talk about those roots, Felicia? Like, oh my gosh. Um, anyways, yeah, so that's kind of what I'm... Oh, and this, this is the tart lip, the lip stain, and it's very smoothing and it goes on nice. And look at the color, like I love, I, I love that. So. <clears throat> so yeah, um, this is the finished look. Uh, nothing too exciting, nothing too extravagant. Um, just something that I wanted to kind of put my best face forward today and kind of face Thailand with my best face. <laughs> uh, yeah, but I will show you guys Thailand. It is so gorgeous. If you guys haven't been here, if you ever get the chance to come, please do come. Um, I love it. It's to die for. Um, I would definitely come back. But yes, this was the full look. And um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. I really appreciate it. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you do like these talk through videos, do let me know. Um, <clears throat> I quite enjoy doing them. I mean, even though I'm like sitting in a room, talking to myself, kind of chit chatting right there and just be like, hi. <laughs> um, it's good, I mean. I, I like it, so I'll probably keep doing videos like these in the future. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, until next time, ciao.